Hi everyone, today we're going to take a look at how to synchronize your DFAM to Ableton Live using CV tools. So the first thing we want to do is we actually want to bring our audio in from our DFAM. So I'm going to go into Live and select our external instrument device. I'm going to load that onto a, a MIDI track. And I've got our chooser window here that says audio from. In this case, I'm going to use our audio input one. Let's go ahead and check audio from the DFAM. So I'll hit the run stop button. Now we want to go to the next step, which is synchronizing the DFAM with Ableton Live using CV tools. So I'm going to go ahead and advance the DFAM down to step eight. That way when I start playback in live, everything will come in on the downbeat. So let's go ahead and open up our packs folder and go to CV tools. I'm going to open that, go to this folder called CV utilities. And inside there, you'll see a device called CV clock out. I'm going to drag that in on the same track. We have our audio coming in from DFAM with our external instrument device. I'm going to select eighth note on the CV clock out. Similar to how we worked with the external instrument device and bringing our audio in from DFAM is actually selecting our clock output from, in this case, the Apollo Twin and bringing that into live into the DFAM. So I'm going to go to the chooser that says no output. I'm going to select external out and underneath in the sub chooser, I'll select output number three. In this case, that's the analog output from the Apollo Twin. So today I'm using a standard 3.5 to quarter inch cable coming out of the twin. I'm going to take that cable, run it into the advanced clock in on DFAM. I'm going to go ahead and select run stop. And now when I launch Ableton Live, everything should be in sync. So we can also check our synchronization by turning on Live's metronome and firing off the DFAM one more time. And since everything's synced up, now we can use our time-based effects in Live to start adding delay. We can also go into the CV clock out device and change that resolution from eighth note to quarter. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos with CV Tools and your Mo Gear.